Welcome back to Albany County Fasteners, Fasteners 101. I'm Bob, and today I'm going to talk about installing a lag screw into concrete with a lag shield. So let's get started. So I have here a lag shield, which is made for concrete. We've gotten many requests about how to install a lag screw into concrete. So it's pretty simple. Um, you would have to have a lag shield. In this case, this is a 3 8 lag, lag bolt or lag screw. Um, and here's a lag shield, which is made for concrete. The lag shield, you would drill a hole the size of the diameter of the lag shield, in this case for 3 8 And if you're using a lag shield for 3 8 it would be 5 8 outside diameter. You would drill a hole in the concrete uh, for the length of like, 5 8 by the length of the lag shield and just a little bit more than that. Um, and then you would hammer in the lag shield into the concrete. How this works is, you'll see, I'll take this apart, it's two pieces that comes apart, okay? There are these two clips on here that go into the top area here. Okay, I'm gonna put it back together. And I put it back together. And then when you put, after you put it in the concrete, and you put the lag screw in, You'll start to see, once you start to screw it in, you'll see the bottom part start to spread. And that's how it locks into the concrete. And if you're taking a 2x4 or a piece of plywood or whatever you're fastening to the concrete, um, that's uh, the product you would use uh, for doing that. This um, lag shield, when you put it into concrete, the top of it should be flush with the top of the concrete. So you'll take a hammer, you'll hammer it into place, and that'll finish off with the top of the concrete. And then if you're having a piece of two by four, um, and plus whatever length you wanna go into the lag shield. So for instance, if you had a two by four, it'd be an inch and a half plus the amount of um, um, area you're going to screw into a lag shield, which would be about another inch to inch and a half. So you use a three inch lag screw. And you would just fasten it down, torque it down, and it would stay perfect in there forever. Um, depending on your, um, your environment that you're installing this, these are zinc products. There are lag shields that are available in stainless also. Uh, for high corrosion areas, um, and you can find those on our website. Thanks for watching. There you go. Subscribe, like, comment. Visit us at albanycountyfasteners.com for 50,000 SKUs right off the rack, ready to ship. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.